this team is mostly based on defense, and that's where Coach Spo and even Coach Quinn today said everything starts. But you guys also know you have a lot of weapons. So does it shock you to look at a box score and see that you had the 23 threes or 144 points, or is that still sort of a little bit overwhelming? Uh, you know, obviously tonight uh, we, we kind of got it going. So it's not every night's going to be like this, but obviously, you know, we are capable as well. We got a lot of guys that can – score it and especially when we're playing unselfish like that finding people in, in spots where they can be successful we can be pretty tough to guard Duncan I know tonight was obviously a franchise record like Ira said but over the last five games you guys have been shooting the ball really well from three there's been so much talk about kind of maximizing Jimmy and, and Bam you know with all the rotation changes but how do you think that the changes you guys have made has maybe helped the outside shooters um I, th- I think it's just you know continuing to play to our strengths um and you know, for them, that's that's getting in the ball and in situations where they can put pressure on the rim and be successful. And you know, it's a symbiotic relationship in that sense. Um, you know, them putting pressure on the rim allows three point shooters to get open. And you know, once you hit shots, then it creates more space for them. Uh, Duncan, usually everybody's always encouraging you to shoot more. Uh, have you guys been encouraging Jimmy to shoot more with the three point shot? It feels like he's been on a bit of a run here with that. Yeah, for sure. I mean, he's. He's obviously capable, you know. He's been uh, way more than capable his whole career. Uh, so yeah, we're we're always, especially when he's open like that, you know, let it fly for sure. Okay, you got to, to twenty-seven minutes tonight, which makes sense given how you were shooting. But I'm just curious, is in the role you're playing right now, are you thinking more or less at all about how many minutes you're going to play night tonight, or do you feel like you have a good idea of like what your shift is going to be every time? I mean, it's it's going to be different, you know. It's uh, that's kind of what this year's been in, in a lot of senses. Uh, the role and involvement and, and everything has looked different on night to night, and that's what you get when you play on a good team with a lot of guys that can do a lot of different things. So, you know, for me, it's just about wrapping my mind around that. Um, and you know, it's it's definitely not something that's that's easy per se. Um, but everyone's going through it, and it's it's sacrifice. Uh, you know, when you get on a good team like this that wants to do something special, that's what it takes. So uh, just continue to wrap my mind around that. And, you know, whatever is required of me on a nightly basis, you know, I'm, I'm willing, you know, I'm, I'm two feet in, four feet in, whatever you want to call it, uh, just to help us, you know, be better and try to get a win. I will go via Zoom to Christo Saltas. Hey, Duncan, great game, great win, first of all. Uh, for you, those type of games at this stage of the season, how beneficial are for your preparation about the playoffs? Uh, you know, this time of year, uh, you know, it's all about fine tuning and, and wanting to play your best basketball. Uh, you know, come the most important games. So, we got two left, um, and there's definitely things that we can take away, uh, both positive and negative, from this one uh, going into a playoff series for sure. All right, next we'll go to Josh Mosier. Hey, Duncan, just kind of a fun question: How much did guarding Cody remind you of guarding Caleb in practice? <laughs> uh, yeah, you know, you, you got to take a couple glances uh, just to process it every now and then. Uh, I actually told him during the game, I was like, man, I feel like I know you. <laughs> and, I, and I don't know him at all. Uh, but, you know, just knowing knowing Caleb and, and uh, you know, having him be a part of this this year and, and moving forward uh, has been cool. It's, it's you know, I'm sure they're, they're very similar in a lot of ways. Uh, so in a sense, I, you know, I, I kind of do know uh, Cody. Thank you. All right, Duncan, thank you. Yeah.